Hello, there's Doom. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Okay. That's a good intro. Hello, yeah. ladies and gentlemen. We are back with another video for the. Are we? Yes, we are for the brand <laughs> split. The blue brand, the best brand, the SmackDown brand. SmackDown Live. So it's a 1 1 currently in the ratings. Yeah. I got an 82B again. Yeah. I reckon this, this could beat it. You reckon? I reckon. Hmm. We'll Let's start. That. Let's start. In our first pre-show match, Randy Orton defeats Damien Sandow with an RKO, so no punt this weekend on the pre-show. B minus 73. It's Damien bloody Sandow, though. <laughs> you don't want to hurt that genius head. Well, he's giving him a bloody RKO. Of course it's going to hurt his head. <laughs> <laughs> we don't want to punt it. In a, another pre-show match, 49D+, plus, Kenny Omega defeats Victor. And Kenny Omega debuts. Yep, debuts his egomaniac gimmick. Got an average, not too bad. Next segment. C-56. Oh, is that the Motor City Machine Guns defeating Breezango? No way! Oh my god! They both no. get got 60 in-ring performances, which is good. Yeah. Yeah. I think now is the start of the show. Yep, 88B+. plus. We've got a show opening. Nice. All decent. AJ Styles, Del Rio, Wyatt, Ambrose, Ziggler, Cena, Orton, and The Miz. All involved mm -hmm. in that next segment. And our opening matchup gets us... 68C plus in about bad decent wrestling, but didn't have much heat. Shinsuke Nakamura defeated Rhino in 618 when Rhino got intentionally disqualified. Nakamura and Rhino have great chemistry. <laughs> yes, yes. Why are you getting all the chemistry and I'm getting like <laughs> nothing? Oh. Uh, next, we have Daniel Bryan announcing Nakamura vs Rhino for SummerSlam. And dun, dun, dun. announcing that this time Rhino won't be able to get intentionally disqualified because there'll be no DQ. Ooh, we might have to make a no DQ match. We might. Oh. Yeah, go make a no DQ match because the other one's hardcore based and Shinsuke okay. is not that good at hardcore. Great match type. Regular. And call it no DQ. No DQ. Uh, match name DQ. No DQ. No DQ. All right. So weapons, basically. Uh, yeah. That should be all right. Yeah, that's it. Uh, I think we're gonna have to. There we go. No DQ match. Rhino, Shinsuke Nakamura. Go, 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 go. Yeah, that, some of those are going on the free show. <laughs> yes. Maybe half. <laughs> 70C plus for that. Decent rating. Decent. Next, D plus 49. For 40 minutes, attack American Alpha backstage, leaving them down and out. <gasps> They're no longer ready, willing, and gable. No. Not for today, uh, at least. Next segment. In a 59C minus, about a decent wrestling, but then I've got heat. Heath Slater defeated Jey Uso by pinfall with a slingshot called Screw Splash, following <laughs> interference from Samoa Joe. How is Slater getting so many wins? <laughs> I don't know. He, like, lost two. He, he's two in two right now. <laughs> yeah. It's because, you know, SmackDown brand knows real talent. And the, uh, the announcer has put over the fact that we'll be seeing Samoa Joe take on both Jey Uso and Jimmy Uso in a handicap match at SummerSlam. What the hell is going on? We've got... I, I genuinely don't believe how many stories we've got going on and yeah. how big it I, is. This is, it's good that we uh, made brand-exclusive pay-per-views. 
Oh, yes. We might have to, like, turn the big four into bigger shows. Yeah, like four hours each, I reckon. Maybe. We'll, we'll see after SummerSlam, see how it is. Yeah. Wait, but... should I count how many matches we have so far? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twenty. 12, 13, 14. 14? 14. 14 matches. Jeez. Next Half of them are title matches. In a 60C, in a decent match, when Mears defeated Kalisto in 1305 by pinfall of a school crushing finale. Hmm. Decent. Next segment. 58C minus a segment called Kenny Let's Team. So basically, Heath Slater sees Kenny Omega backstage. He sees that he's got they've got matching shades on. He sees you know the whole rock star vibe Kenny Omega has, and he like he likes what he sees. So he asks Kenny Omega to team with him. Kenny Omega thinks a bit, and he agrees. So we've got ourselves a new team here on SmackDown. Yeah, the Rock and Rolling Express. No, it's called the Rock Star Club. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. Two MB. 2 MB, yeah. Next segment. We're a two-man band! <laughs> in a 66C+, plus, in about a decent wrestling, but didn't have much heat, Wyatt and Rowan defeated the Hype Bros in 954 when Bray Wyatt defeated Mo- Mojo Rawley by pinfall with Sister Abigail. During the match, we also had the Miz, this Jack Ryder. <gasps> no. <laughs> um, Ryder and Mojo don't work well as a team. Oh. Well, that's a team gone, then. Yep. Hmm. Goodbye, hype bros. Bye-bye. Yeah, that, that 28 in, in-ring performance for Mojo Rawley. Yeah, I guess we're not getting hyped anymore. No. We're Next getting segment. sort of dampened. In an 84B+, Bray Wyatt is celebrating his victory in the ring. Randy Orton runs in and attacks, beating Bray Wyatt down into the mat. It's an RKO out of somewhere. Out of somewhere. No way. Yes way. No way. Yes way. Next segment. Jeez. In an A94, John Cena comes out, says that he will take the open... Uh, he'll, oh, no. It should be the wrong, uh, the other way around. Ignore that. Um, Shelton Benjamin comes out. Shelton Benjamin comes out saying that he will accept the open challenge that John Cena issued. Cool. Shelton Benjamin looked lost out there. You were John Bloody Cena, of course. You're gonna look lost. Do you reckon he like walked out and like down the ramp and he couldn't find the ring? Yeah. He like went straight into the crowd. (laughs) Yeah. Next segment. 75B minus, in about bad, great wrestling and good heat. John Cena defeated Shelton Benjamin in 1052 with an attitude adjustment. Not bad, not bad. Hmm, it's the psychology. Yeah, that's weird because Cena should have decent sight. Yeah. I mean, he can definitely call in the ring. Mm. Everyone's heard him call in the ring. <laughs> yep. Next segment 98A star. John Cena comes down to the ring, he takes a microphone and starts talking to the crowd, before eventually getting interrupted by AJ Styles. They have a big argument, going back and forth on the microphone, before things get uh, things take a violent turn and they start brawling. Uh, a, wa- <laughs> a whole host of staff hit the ring to break them up, and as they are pushed uh, apart, it is clear a match is going to take place between them. Yep. Yeah. That's yeah. That's pretty clear. Yes. 52D plus in the battle of had sub bar wrestling and little heat. Jesus. Samoa Joe defeated uh, Tommy Morrison in 52 seconds by pinfall for Coquina Clutch. They have great, great chemistry. chemistry. Yeah. But it lasted a minute. Samoa Joe is looking stale <laughs> already. He's had yeah. three matches. And he's looking stale. <laughs> looking very stale. Oh my god. You might have to tweak his gimmick. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> Next segment, 73B minus, a video plays hyping up Dean Ambrose, Dolph Ziggler, and Alberto De Rio. And the main, ev- main event gets a uh, 82B. In the battle, I've had 
uh, great wrestling and good heat. Dolph Ziggler and Dean Ambrose defeated Alberto Del Rio and AJ Styles when Dean Ambrose defeated Alberto Del Rio with a dirty deeds. Dun, dun, dun. Dolph Ziggler's not suited to his gimmick. He was off his game. Like, really off his game. This match got the crowd hotter and stuff. Yeah. Ambrose being the best there. Yeah. And Ziggler being the worst. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and we end off with a 93A. Dean Ambrose is celebrating. Dolph Ziggler beats Ambrose down to the mat. Oh, just yeah. super kicks him. It just yeah, super just kicks super him. Super kicks. It's like the face they just teamed, but Dolph Ziggler wants to make an uh, makes uh, make a statement saying, "I like you, Ambrose, but I don't like you enough to let you retain that title. I'm winning it at SummerSlam, and there's nothing you can do to stop me." Cool. End the show with uh, eighty-five B plus. <laughs> Ooh, it's close. Yeah, closer than last time. About it's about the same. Mm. Smackdown is back on top. Ladies and gentlemen, hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe to me and Charles, and bye.